syndicated columnist Charles Krauthammer. Charles, your thoughts? Well, what strikes me is the, uh, the part of the reason for the psychological shock is that if you think about it, Brett, this is the first successful the bombing terror explosion since 9-11. We've had some that were attempted, like the one in Times Square that never succeeded. We've had, by my count, about 10 terror attacks in the U.S. since 9-11. All of them have been shootings, with one exception, which is a, a man who drove a car into a crowd at University of North Carolina. But this is the first explosion. I think that's what gives this the sort of psychological resonance. People running in the street of a big city. The smoke, of course, it's nowhere near the scale of 9-11, but it's the first time. And I think that is sort of the historical echo that we're feeling, and it reminds us of how vulnerable we felt uh, at the beginning of this whole decade of terror, and that even though we thought we had largely escaped, and we have largely escaped, it is still out there.